time began My life was in his hand My name is Yasmin and I am 18 years old. After being in a relationship with my only boyfriend since I was 15, I found myself with an unplanned pregnancy and all alone. Abortion was the first thought that came to my mind. On that medical bed waiting for the doctor to do the abortion, I was so confused and I didn't want to kill my baby. The nurse started to do the ultrasound and I begged her to let me see my baby. She refused to show me the ultrasound screen, telling me it was only tissue. But I knew it was my baby. I started to cry. I felt so alone with no one to help me. She got nervous and I told her I wanted to leave. I found myself homeless, but thanks to a friend that took me to her house, I had a place to sleep that night. The next morning, she took me to Heartbeat of Miami for help. At the clinic, I met Martha. I was so blessed to meet her. We saw my baby on the ultrasound screen. I was eight weeks pregnant. My daughter, Rosabella, will be born the first week of August. I have a full scholarship and I will finish this semester at Miami Day North. I will take time off from school to be with my baby and I will attend FIU and pursue a medical career. And he knows my name. Hello, my name is Sianni. I was 15 years old when I found out that I was pregnant. I had seen a clinic in my neighborhood and thought that I could get rid of this huge problem because now that I was pregnant, I knew I had to get an abortion. When I walked into the pregnancy health medical clinic, and sat down with the counselor, she began to explain to me about how my baby already had a heartbeat and that abortion was not my only way out. They told me about all the help that they could offer me. When I finally saw my baby on an ultrasound, I could not believe what I was looking at. I also started going to the parenting classes and learned so much about taking care of my baby. With the baby dollars I received each time I attended the classes, I was able to buy everything that I needed for my baby. My daughter motivated me so much. I will be graduating a year early and I will begin college at the age of 16. If it wasn't for Heartbeat of Miami and the support that they gave me, Aaliyah wouldn't be here today. He knows my every thought. My name is Stephanie Pena. When I first found out I was pregnant, I was only 15 scared and very vulnerable. I told a close friend who shared her story. She had aborted three pregnancies and today she can no longer have children. She didn't want me to make the same mistake. She then introduced me to the Heartbeat of Miami clinic. It was there that I found help and I found God. They provided me with a free ultrasound. Today, I am married and we have our son, Zachary. Hello, my name is Melissa, and I would like to share a wonderful story that changed my life. When I found out that I was pregnant, I didn't know what to do. The first thing that came to my mind was to abort my baby, and as I looked in the yellow pages, I found an ad for a clinic that said, pregnant, need help. So I had called and set up an appointment. I felt so relieved that I was closer to solve my problem. When I walked in that day, the staff member was very nice and helpful to me. They helped me through everything that I needed to know and taught me how to care for my baby. Now that my son is seven months old and very happy and active, I want to thank Heartbeat of Miami for all that they have done. I have since graduated from North Miami Senior High and will be soon graduating from ATI College of Health with my degree in medical assistant. He sees each tear that falls and hears me when I call. My name is Ileana Jamie. At 15 and a student in Hylia High School, I found myself with an unplanned pregnancy. I was scared and did not know what to do. I remember that I had seen a place next to my school that said Pregnancy Help Medical Clinic. At this clinic, my pregnancy was confirmed by Jeannie, who was warm and loving, making me feel welcomed. I was going to be a mommy. With butterflies in my stomach, I knew I wanted to have my baby. I had to face my mother, and she thought abortion was the only option for me. What about school, college, life? I called Jeannie, and she asked my mother to come visit her. She prayed with us, and my mother changed her heart. Thanks to Heartbeat of Miami, my son Noel is now two years old. 
I am now in college attending Miami Day North Campus. My name is Alba Pagan. I had no one and found myself alone with a boyfriend that was forcing me to abort my baby. While on the abortion table, I realized what I was about to do and ran out of that place almost naked. I went to a place of refuge, heartbeat of Miami's pregnancy clinic in Hialeah. I thank God and heartbeat of Miami for their support. The women at the clinic gave me love, counseling, and told me it was okay to have my baby. That is all I needed to hear. Now today, Gabriela Camila is two years old, and blessings are overabundant. Happily married, and all because of Heartbeat of Miami. Let the hurt me say, he knows my name.